Hi guys, welcome to Studio Wildlife. Today I'm going to be talking about how I manage my time for artwork against my full-time job. I work as a biology teacher and one of the hardest things for me is finding the time to actually sit down and paint. I love the summer holidays for this, but during term time I have to find a balance between planning, marking and prepping my schoolwork and creating art. For me, the biggest obstacle is time. When I get home from work and finally settle down, I don't have the motivation or the hours left in the day to start a huge painting. When I first started my job, I found it a real challenge to pick up brushes or pencils and start creating after work. I saw that I only had an hour or so to spare, and I thought, what's the point in painting? With so little time, I'll just sit there and watch Netflix instead. I started to miss painting and drawing more and more, until it got to the point where I decided to use my time a bit more effectively. Instead of focusing on large, perfectly rendered paintings, I switched my focus and style to simplified sketches using charcoal or paint. This bear is an example of one of those sketches. I'm using acrylic paints, but I'm using a much looser style than my usual, more realistic paintings. I spend between 30 minutes and an hour on each painting, and I try to limit myself to only using a basic colour palette of about 6 to 7 colours. For these sketches I invested in a pad of watercolour paper to use, which works great with the acrylics, as I use them with very thin washes of water very similar to how people use watercolour paints anyway. I try to get one of these paintings done every day. I treat them as little sketches rather than full paintings, and I sell them for about £50 each, so they aren't big money makers. What they do is let me practice my art and help me to keep creating even on the days that I'm working, even on the days that I have to take all of my work home. It was that switch in motivation and the commitment to sitting down and actually painting that's actually helped me improve my artwork in the last couple of years. My advice to everyone who's in the same boat as me is to actually commit a small amount of time to your art. You don't have to be creating masterpieces, and every piece you make doesn't need to be perfect. You just need to get into the habit and mindset of creating something small and quick every day. I found that by doing this, I actually improved some of my painting skills, like my brushwork, composition and colour mixing. And by sticking to strict, short time limits, I'm beginning to learn more about effective and efficient painting and making sure that every brushstroke counts. By setting aside an hour of my day every day just to paint, I've found that I'm much happier in myself and have a much more balanced lifestyle. I'm never going to make an art career out of these little sketches, but I have weekends and holidays to focus on my larger pieces and commissions. If anyone else has any tips for managing their job with their art, please leave a comment below. I'd love to hear them. As always, thanks for watching and remember to like and subscribe for more wildlife art tips.